Hello dear students, how are you? Hope that you are in sound health and staying home. You know, due to global crisis of COVID-19, all educational institutions of Bangladesh are closed and your school also closed. You know that uh, the COVID-19 has already taken a pandemic shape in the whole world. So you had better stay home. We don't have any contract for many days because your school is closed. So your school authority has decided to run online class. Today I will take a class. Welcome to my class. Here you see my profile. I am MD Mustaqim, assistant teacher, English, Bandarwan Canton Public School and College. My today's topic is connector, subject, English second paper for class 9 and 10. You know, connector is very important topic in your English grammar. You face it in question paper at question number 10. And students often very confused when they face this item in the exam. So, today I have decided to take a class on this topic. Learning outcome. After the completion of this class, you would be able to learn connectors, learn types of connectors used in sentences, learn function of different connectors, make sentences by using connectors. So, at first, you should know <coughs> what are connectors. We use some words or phrases in order to maintain the cohesion or continuity of the sentences. Those words or phrases are called linking words or sentence connectors or simply connectors. For example, as a result, furthermore, despite, for example, however, as a consequence, even though finally, therefore, but next, in fact, of course, in brief, on the other hand, etc. These are all example of connectors. So, dear students, for your better understanding, here I have given some example of connectors in in this text. I study the following sentences to get idea about the use of linking words or connectors. Number one, prices fell by more than 20% last year. As a result, sales increased by 15%. Here you see one connected use between the two sentences. As a result, number two, desktop computers are cheaper and more reliable than laptops. Furthermore, they are flexible. Here you see two connected used and furthermore. Number three, on the whole his speech was well received despite some complaints from new members. Here you also see two connector used on the whole despite both written in bold. I have been to many countries. For example, I have been to Russia, Canada, Mexico and Spain. Number five, she hates house cleaning. On the other hand, she does not mind cooking. Number six, there are many benefits to exercising. However, you must take some precaution to avoid injury. In these sentences, you see some connectors are used, all are written in bold. Now, we will see types of connectors. There are various types of connectors. We can divide them into coordinating conjunction, subordinating conjunction, correlative conjunction. Apart from conjunction, relative pronouns and adverb or adverbial phrases can be used as connectors. That means if you want to do well in connectors, you must have a sound knowledge on conjunction relative pronoun and
and adverbs. So let's see what is coordinating conjunction. Coordinating conjunctions are the most common form of linking words or connectors. They are used to join two independent clauses together. Generally in the middle of a sentence, there are, there are seven coordinating conjunctions. They are and, but, so, or, for, not, yet. Now, subordinating conjunctions. Subordinating conjunctions are linking words that are used to join clauses together. They join a dependent clause with an independent clause. Example of subordinating conjunctions are before, when, if, because, although, etc. Then correlative conjunction. Correlative conjunctions connect equal sentence elements together like two nouns and are always composed by two words. Example of creative conjunction are both and not only but also not but either or neither nor whether or as as etc. So now we will see the most important part of to this class here you see function of the sentence connectors or use of the sentence connectors. It is the most important point for you here. So hope that you will give 100% concentration when we read this slide. Number one, connectors used to mean the sequence or chronology of events. There are some connectors in English that show sequence or chronology of events like first, firstly, at first, second, secondly, third, thirdly, fourth, fourthly, at the end, lastly, at last, finally, to sum up in conclusion, last but not the least, next, afterwards, after that, then, etc. Examples here I have given examples where this connector used. In order to open a bank account, you have to follow some steps. First, you have to collect a form from the bank. Then, you have to fill up the form accordingly. After that, you need to submit the form to the manager. Finally, the manager will give approval to open a bank account for you. In this text, you see some connector use all are written in bold for you. You see these connectors describe the sequence of the events now number two connectors used to provide additional information in english there are some connectors that show additional information or they use to add more information example and additionally besides further furthermore especially not only but also moreover both and or either or neither nor as well as to likewise also in addition so on apart from similarly again here i have shown them in the following text how they use in a text both hassan and habib obtain the same bed either she or her brother came here to study i will neither go nor ask anybody to go there he as well as his father will come tomorrow. He is a meritorious student. In addition, he is a good player. So here you see the connector used in bowl show additional information. Number three. There are some connectors in English they are used to give example. Like such as namely, for example, for instance, that is, etc. Now you will see them in the following text how they use examples he is an expert in a, in, in a number of areas such as mathematics physics chemistry medicine etc there are a lot of benefits of early rising for instance one can inhale fresh air number four connectors used to indicate contrast you know contrast means that show opposite sense from the previous or next one 
The connectors used to show contrast are on the contrary, instead, on the other hand, but yet still while whereas though, although, even though, despite, in spite of, however, nevertheless, nonetheless. Here in the text I have shown them how they use in a sentence. Examples, he studied hard but he failed. Here you see but use we show a contrast okay, with the previous statement. He studied hard but he failed. So you see here a clear contrast between the two statements. The government has increased salary of employees. On the other hand, or on the contrary, it has increased the rate of tax on income. In spite of being a regular student, <coughs> she could not pass in the examination. Hassan is very hard working person, whereas his brother is lazy. Here you see the connector used to show contrast. Number 5. Connectors used in comparison. There are some connectors in English they are used to show comparison. For example, similarly, likewise, in the same way, then, as, as, so, as, to, correspondingly, equally. Look at the example. He is taller than his elder brother. She is an expert in computer technology. Likewise, she has expertise in mobile technology too. She is as beautiful as a doll. She does in the same way her mother liked. So here you see the connector used to show comparison. Now look at number 6. Con connectors used to express cause or effect. So there are some connectors that are used to show cause or effect. Example scenes for because as why so that so therefore as a result of as a consequence of etc. Example I don't know why she is crying. I could not go to the office because my mother was sick. I am not attending your part tonight as I will be flying tonight. You see connector use here to show cause and effect. Now look at number 6, connectors used to express result. There are some connectors, they are used to show result, like so, therefore, hence, as a result of, as a consequence of, thus, consequently, eventually, so that, accordingly, now. There are students look at the example, how this linkers or connectors used in the sentence. The electricity has gone out so we have to wait until it comes again. He did not attend the class regularly therefore he did not get attendance mark. I don't have the habit of getting up in the morning as a consequence I fall sick often. In the text you see connectors used to show or to express result. Now look at number 8. Connectors used to express the purpose of any action. There are some connectors in English. They are used to express or to show the purpose of any action. Like as much as, as many as, so that, in order that, least, so as to. There is student look at the example. Uh, in the text, how they use in the sentence to express the purpose of any action. I keep the door open so as to let fresh air enter into the room. The boy is studying hard so that or uh, in order that he can do well in the examination. He ate as many ice cream as he could. Now, look at number nine. Connectors used to put condition. Some connectors known as condition connectors. These connectors are used to show condition like if, otherwise, unless, till, until, provided, provided that, in case, 
as long as there is student look at the example how they use in a text if you call me i will come to help you study hard or otherwise you have to face difficulty in the examination wait here until or till i come back so here you can see clearly that the linkers use to show condition number 10 connectors used to indicate time and place dear students some connectors are used to show or indicate time and place like at that time they are where when while before after since as soon as sometimes at present presently of late now then afterwards at first once no sooner had then look at the example how they use in the text she is a writer at the same time she is a singer they had arrived at the station before the train started she wanted to know where i come from as soon as the singer came on the stage the audience applauded look at number 11 here you see connectors used to indicate conclusion the students there are some connectors in english they are used to indicate conclusion or to tell and like to sum up in brief in short in fine to summarize on the whole above all in all in conclusion to conclude the student look at the example to see how they use in the text he is good at mathematics english physics and other subjects above all he is a brilliant student we have three english teachers two bengali teachers and four science teacher in total we have nine teachers at our college he has established a school in the village he helps people at the time of natural disaster he donates money to poor students in brief he is a very kind hearted man now look at number 12 you know that related pronouns use as connectors and here i have given some related pronouns that are used as connectors like who which whom whose what whatever whichever that example i know the person who came here last night can you see who use that is a relative pronoun as connector this is the book which i need i will give you whatever you want so dear student uh, today we have finished our lesson here now i have given a task for you that is exercise uh, complete the passage using suitable connectors thank you